welcome back to my channel. Now, in this video, I have given my copper hair a little bit of a refresh from my home. If you live in the UK, you know that we have been in lockdown pretty much from November now. There was a couple of weeks in December where things were a bit more open, and that is the last time that I had my hair dyed. It is now March, and my next appointment has been moved to April. So, my hair was looking very faded, and I have got roots, as you can see. That can't be avoided. But my lovely hairdresser gave me some advice to help get rid of the wishy-washy faded look of my copper hair, which it's safe to say her advice has definitely worked. So in this video, I am showing you how I went from this to this. Now, I am absolutely over the moon. There are definitely parts of my hair that are still a little bit faded, particularly at the ends here. But the main colour, if you look at this section, there is some beautiful coppery red tones in there. And the colour is definitely lifted, feels fresher, my hair looks thicker and in better condition now. So I am so chuffed. And this cost me £10 to do and took about five minutes. So, I will leave you to watch the video. I am very much looking forward to doing this. As you can see, need to wash my hair. It's actually got to the point now where when I wash my hair, there is no leakage in the shower. So literally the color has just been drained out of it. So what I have are two crazy color hair dyes. Now this technique has been recommended by my hairdresser. I know that she feels very strongly about staying away from bottle dyes because it will mess it up once I can actually go back to her for an appointment to have my hair properly redone. So here we have crazy color in orange and coral red. So my hair is a copper red color. It has some orange tones in it and it also has some red tones in it. I will be putting, I'll be washing my hair and then I will be putting two blobs of orange and one blob of red and I will mix that together with my conditioner and just leave it on for, I think I'm gonna just go for about five minutes. These are semi-permanent hair color creams. I think if you're properly dyeing it, you leave it on for about half an hour. So it's gonna be much more subtle than that. But the idea being that it just gets rid of this wishy-washy color until I can get my hair properly dyed again, which the appointment is booked, but it is still a while away. So it will have been a very long time. And honestly, I know you cannot see my roots right now, but yeah, they're the biggest they have ever been. To be fair, it actually doesn't look that bad, especially if I put my hair like half up, half down, or tie up in a messy bun or whatever. It really doesn't look that bad, but it will be good to get a little bit of brightness back. So there are those. These were both pretty much five pounds and I got them off of Amazon. And I did send her the links to make sure that they will be okay. What is odd is that if you look at these colors here, the coral red looks way more orange than the orange one does. This looks more red, but we are just gonna go with two blobs of orange, one blob of coral red, and we'll just see what happens, I guess. I also have some gloves. Now I feel these are very important because this is hair dye and I really don't want to dye my hair. The copper refresh I normally use in the shower, it does kind of stay in your hands, but then it does come off as you finish your shower, but that is meant to be like a top up. These are hair dyes, so we got the gloves here. So anyway, I am going to hop on in to the shower and I will show you the result. <laughs> see this was super super easy and you can do absolutely everything from the comfort of your home and it doesn't take long and yes I still have roots and it doesn't look as brilliant as it does once I've been to the hairdresser but this has been a really quick and easy way to lift the color get rid of the wishy-washy look and not give my hairdresser a really hard time in refreshing my hair properly when I go back for my next appointment. I think I will probably do this routine every time I wash my hair now because it's so quick and easy and the results, I can imagine, are only going to get better. 
So there you are. I really hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please like, please subscribe, and I will see you again soon. Bye-bye.